Surrey and Holm Cuthbert CBE, 12 September 1931-19 June 2020, known as Ian Holm, was an English actor on stage and in film. He received the 1967 Tony Award for Best Featured Actor for his performance as Lenny in The Homecoming and the 1998 Laurence Olivier Award for Best Actor for his performance in the title role of King Lear. He won the 1981 BAFTA Award for Best Actor in a Supporting Role for his role as athletics trainer Sam Musabini in Chariots of Fire, for which he was also nominated for an Academy Award. His other well-known film roles include Ash and Alien, Father Vito Cornelius in The Fifth Element, Chef Skinner in Ratatouille, and Bilbo Baggins in The Lord of the Rings and The Hobbit film series. Holm was born Ian Holm Cuthbert on 12 September 1931 in Goodmays, in Essex, to Scottish parents, James Harvey Cuthbert and his wife Jean Wilson, Nee Holm. His father was a psychiatrist who worked as the superintendent of the West Ham Corporation Mental Hospital and was one of the pioneers of electric shock therapy, and his mother was a nurse. He had an older brother, Eric, who died in 1943. Holm was educated at the independent Chigwell School in Essex. His parents retired to Mordeho Devon and then Worthing where he joined an amateur dramatic society. A visit to the dentist led to an introduction to Henry Bainton, a well-known provincial Shakespearean actor who helped Holm train for admission to the Royal Academy of Dramatic Art, where he secured a place in 1949. His studies there were interrupted a year later when he was called up for national service in the British Army, during which he was posted to Klagenfurt, Austria, and attained the rank of Lance Corporal. They were then interrupted a second time when he volunteered to go on an acting tour of the United States in 1952. Holm finally graduated from Rada in 1953, whilst there he had been offered spear-carrying roles at Stratford, and he stayed there for 13 years, soon graduating to more significant roles and abandoning plans to move on after Peter Hall founded the Royal Shakespeare Company in 1960. Holm was an established star of the Royal Shakespeare Company before making an impact on television and film. In 1965, he played Richard III in the BBC serialization of The Wars of the Roses, based on the RSC production of the plays. In 1969, he played the lead in Dennis Potter's Moonlight on the Highway, and gradually he made a name for himself with minor roles in films such as Oh! What a Lovely War, 1969, Nicholas and Alexandra, 1971, Mary, Queen of Scots, 1971, and Young Winston, 1972. In 1967, he won a Tony Award for Best Featured Actor in a Play as Lenny in the Homecoming by Harold Pinter. In 1977, Holm appeared in the TV miniseries Jesus of Nazareth as the Sadducee Zara and a villainous Moroccan in March or Die. The following year he played J.M. Barry in the award-winning BBC TV series The Lost Boys, in which his son Barnaby played the young George Llewellyn Davies. In 1981, he played Frodo Baggins in BBC radio adaptation of J.R.R. Tolkien's Lord of the Rings. Holmes' first film role to have a major impact was that of the treacherous android, Ash, in Ridley Scott's Alien, 1979. His portrayal of Sam Musabini in Chariots of Fire, 1981, earned him a special award at the Cannes Film Festival and an Academy Award nomination for Best Supporting Actor. Back home in England, he won a BAFTA Award for Best Supporting Actor for Chariots. In the 1980s, he had memorable roles in Time Bandits, 1981, Greystick. The Legend of Tarzan, Lord of the Apes, 1984, and Terry Gilliam's Brazil, 1985. He played Lewis Carroll, author of Alice in Wonderland in the Dennis Potter scripted fantasy Dreamchild, 1985. In 1989, Holm was nominated for a BAFTA award for the TV series Game, Set and Match. Based on the novels by Len Dayton, this tells the story of an intelligence officer, Holm, who discovers that his own wife is an enemy spy. He continued to perform Shakespeare and appeared with Kenneth Branagh in Henry V, 1989, and as Polonius to Mel Gibson's Hamlet, 1990. Holm was reunited with Kenneth Branagh in Mary Shelley's Frankenstein, 1994, playing the father of Branagh's Victor Frankenstein. Holm raised his profile in 1997 with two prominent roles, as the stressed but gentle priest Vito Cornelius in The Fifth Element and lawyer Mitchell Stevens in The Sweet Hereafter. In 2001 he starred in From Hell as the physician Sir William Withy Gull. The same year, he appeared as Bilbo Baggins in the blockbuster film The Lord of the Rings. The Fellowship of the Ring, having previously played Bilbo's nephew Frodo Baggins 1981 BBC radio adaptation of The Lord of the Rings. He returned for The Lord of the Rings. The Return of the King, 2003, for which he shared a SAG award for outstanding performance by a cast in a motion picture. He later reprised his role as the elder Bilbo Baggins in the movie The Hobbit. 
An Unexpected Journey in the Hobbit. The Battle of the Five Armies. Martin Freeman portrayed the young Bilbo Baggins in those films. Holm was nominated for an Emmy Award twice for a PBS broadcast of a national theater production of King Lear in 1999 and for a supporting role in the HBO film The Last of the Blonde Bombshells opposite Judy Dench in 2001. Holm provided voiceovers for many British TV documentaries and commercials. Holm appeared in two David Cronenberg films. Naked Lunch, 1991, and Existence, 1999. He was Harold Pinter's favorite actor, the playwright once stating. He puts on my shoe, and it fits Holm played Linny in the first performance of Pinter's masterpiece The Homecoming. He played Napoleon Bonaparte three times. First, in the 1972 television series Napoleon and Love, next, in a cameo comic rendition, in Terry Gilliam's Time Bandits from 1981, third, in 2001, he played the fallen and exiled leader in the fanciful film The Emperor's Nuclear.